What if the very circumstances you're facing right now, whether big or small, are actually God's wide open opportunities to work in your life? Well, stick around because today we're going to explore how every moment, every challenge is a chance for God to reveal his purpose and power in your life. You won't want to miss this. Hello, everyone. Welcome to Life as God Intended. I'm Don Brzezinski, and today we're diving into an important truth for our Christian walk. Our circumstances. We certainly have a lot of different circumstances that we face. And our circumstances, no matter how difficult or insignificant they may seem, are actually wide open opportunities for God to work. Much of our Christian journey involves embracing the present moment and accepting the circumstances that life presents to us. But the question we need to ask ourselves is, do we truly believe that God oversees every detail of our lives and that he reigns sovereignly over his creation? If God isn't in control, then who is? Is there anyone greater or higher than God? The God I serve is omnipotent, all-powerful, and all-loving. There is no contradiction in attributing these qualities to the one who created and sustains the universe. He demonstrated his love for us through his son, Jesus Christ. Yet, in our day-to-day -day lives, we sometimes lose sight of God's constant presence and care. And in those moments, we might be tempted to blame others, complain, or justify our situation. When we do that, we start to see our circumstances as insurmountable obstacles that block our joy and hinder our progress. But here's the key. When we see God as bigger than our circumstances, we begin to recognize that every situation is actually a wide open opportunity for God to show us his perspective and purpose. Take Joseph, for example, in the book of Genesis. Joseph's life was filled with adversity sold into slavery by his own brothers, falsely accused and thrown into prison. His circumstances were nothing short of overwhelming. But even in the darkest moments, Joseph trusted in God's sovereign purpose for his life. Years later, when he had risen to a position of power in Egypt, Joseph told his brothers, But as for you, you thought evil against me, but God meant it unto good, to bring to pass, as it is today, to save much people alive. You can read about it in Genesis chapter 50 and verse 20. What seemed like a series of insurmountable obstacles were, in fact, opportunities for God 
to work for good. And Joseph's story isn't unique. This pattern we see throughout Scripture, and for that matter, in our lives as well. Romans 8.28 reminds us that all things work together for good to them that love God and to them who are called according to His purpose. So, what opportunities are we being given right now? <laughs> they may seem small, like stubbing your toe, or a clogged sink, or an empty stapler, or they could be significant, like conflict with a coworker, family member, or neighbor. Maybe it's a major health issue you're facing or financial crisis, or even a traumatic event. But regardless of the size or severity of the situation, every circumstance is an opportunity for God to demonstrate His grace and manifest His love. As the Apostle Paul reminds us in 2 Corinthians, Chapter 12 and verse 9, God's grace is sufficient and His strength is made perfect in our weakness. When we embrace this truth, we can accept what is, not as a defeat, but as an opportunity to experience God's provision protection, and power. So the next time you find yourself facing what seems like an insurmountable challenge, remember this. God is at work, and your circumstances are wide open opportunity for Him to reveal His grace, love, and purpose in your life. Thank you for watching Life as God Intended. And if today's message encouraged you, I invite you to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and share this video with others who may need to hear it as well. Remember, God is always at work in your life, even when circumstances seem overwhelming. Let's continue to walk in the confidence of His sovereignty together. Until next time, may you experience life as God intended.